Good evening, Mrs. Ika and my friends from Casco. Ladies and gentlemen, I am very pleased to be speaking to you today on this occasion. I hope you are all as excited as I am to be part of this blissful moment. For a few minutes ahead, I would like to draw your attention to share with you how important social distancing is. As we know, COVID-19 is a disease caused by a new coronavirus. It was first reported in Wuhan city in China in December 2019. So how does coronavirus spread? This virus can be spread through communities. People can catch the virus from others who have the virus. This happens when an infected person sneezes or coughs, sending tiny droplets into the air. These drop droplets can land on nose, mouth, or eyes of someone nearby, or even worse be breathed in by someone nearby. People can also get infected if they touch an infected surface by the droplets, then touch their nose, eyes or mouth. So why practicing social distancing is a must? Social distancing is the first step to prevent from the virus. It puts space between people, limit close contact with others outside of our household, even like indoor and outdoor spaces. Since people can spread the virus before they know if they are sick, it is important to stay away from others when possible, even if you or they have no symptoms at all. Social distancing is especially important for people who are at higher risk for suffer illness from COVID-19. These way fewer people get sick at the same time, so doctors and hospitals are better able to keep up with treating those who need care. Some condition changes will support us on practicing social distancing such as closing schools, restaurants, shops, movie theaters, and other places where people gather. Those conditions will surely support us on practicing social distancing. Also, these conditions would keep us not to take public transportation such as buses, subways, taxis, and ride shares. On practicing social distancing, we are not able to go out unless it is necessary. Necessary reasons to go out include buying food, getting medical care, or going for a walk or a bike ride alone or with members of the household. So social distancing or physical distancing is a must to practice with. We should keep space between people outside of the household during this pandemic. So, in addition to everyday step to prevent COVID-19, keeping space between others is one of the best tools. We have to avoid being exposed to this virus and slowing its spread locally and across the country and world. Last but not least, I would like to thank everyone who has come and paid attention on what I deliver today. I hope this speech brings benefits to all of us. I hope things will clear up soon. Um, keep space between others, put the mask on, stay healthy, and stay safe. Thank you.